Uh, hey. <laughs> <laughs> like an eighth we'll, grade book we'll, report. We'll, we'll read it again. <laughs> edit, edit, edit this. A, piss himself. B, stand for hours because sinning caused him too often roll away. <laughs> C, pass out from the intensity. You're about to pass out from reading these questions right here. <laughs> D, have someone feed him because the god used fat fingers couldn't hold food well. <laughs> I'm about to make these answers shorter for you. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to What Do You Know, the show where a robot and his human sidekick quiz guests to find out what they know about movies, TV shows, comic books, and video games for a chance to win cash prizes. See rules of the game in the description below. We can't do the trivia unless we have a contestant slash victim. True. But this week, you are the contestant slash victim. I am. Which means you need to represent somebody in mm. the chat. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. <laughs> Yep, what that's you, right. What are you laughing about Nothing. over there? No, I'm just looking. What are you just giggling looking, about? Looking at the very uh, muscular furries in the oh, chat. Oh, very muscular. Right? Ooh, ooh. Yeah, change it up. Kind of like it now. Yeah, you know. Yeah. You know, people talk bad about furries, but they're sexy. Yeah, I mean, you know. They, they, I'll they, get up all in that fur. <laughs> you go ahead and do so. Yeah, I will. You enjoy. You enjoy. You know, I'll get a lot of, I'll get, I'll get furry on your ass. I feel like you get up in there, you'll die. You'll, you'll be crushed by those thighs. <laughs> those you know biceps. What? I'll die happy. Be worth it. It would. <laughs> uh, it was a great way to go out. Yes. Yes. Uh, you want to sure. pick someone? Sure. Uh, who? Uh, first person who says me. Uh, I see your boy Slaughter. I saw uh, they, they say me. Did I represent your boy Slaughter? Have I represented you before? And don't lie. Don't lie. Have Be I, honest. Yeah. Right. Have I represented you before? He says nope. He says nope. So this is our first Ooh, time. I just want to be that sure. That was down to the just wire. Just want to be sure. Just want to be sure. Ooh, okay. That was a close that one. That was a close one. That was a close one. All right. Your boy slaughtered. He almost died. Mm -hmm. He almost did. He almost got slaughtered. What is Black Panther? A superhero. No, he's black. <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> I suppose he is. Yes. And he's a superhero. And he's a superhero. Okay. And that is what today's trivia is about. Mm -hmm. it's about I got you. Dude. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah you did. Uh, right when you think you know everything. Yeah, that's true. You got me. He is a black superhero. Mm -hmm. Oh, he was. Mm -hmm. Dead now. Well, I mean, there's a Black Panther. Could okay, be played there's by more many black people. Some people out there. More Black Panthers. Yes. There's more blacks and more Panthers. I believe <laughs> okay. so. Okay. Yes. All right then. Oh, well, hey. Yeah. That's what we're doing today. Cool. In honor of Wakanda forever. They called him Kukulka. They call him Kukulka. Ku -ku the Feather Serpent God. Killing him with wings. This eternal war. Get him! Get him! Bite him on the ass! Yeah, yes! Yes! Ah, there you go. Wakanda Forever, the long, much awaited Black Panther sequel. Looks cool. And in honor of that, mm -hmm. we're doing Black Superhero Trivia today. That's a good idea. Question number one. Okay. <clears throat> Hit it! Which is true about the making of Steel starring Shaquille O'Neal? A, the script was written over the course of one weekend. B, Shaq needed an acting coach on set. C, Shaq performed his own stunts. Or D, the film cost 50 million to make. Five, four, three, two, and I'm gonna need your answer. One. I'm gonna go with uh, D, the film cost 50 million to make. The film cost 50 million to make. Well, that just cost you a right answer. You Damn. are wrong, sir. <laughs> you are wrong. Oh, you want the right answer? Yes. All right, here I know it nothing is. about steel. I probably, obviously not. Nope. But you're learning. Yeah, that's fine with Here's me. Here's the answer. Answer C, Shaq performed his own stunts. Producers couldn't find a seven foot, 300 pound <laughs> stunt double for Shaquille O'Neal. So the basketball star had to do all of his own stunts. That's funny. <laughs> I'm gonna do all stunts right now. I'm gonna do flip. You go ahead, Shaq. I don't think you can, Shaq. Go ahead, set me on fire. <laughs> Question number dos. Two. What does it mean, two? I mean, that's English for. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I All mean. All right, get your head back in the game. Here you go. Which controversial scene was left out of the Will Smith superhero film Hancock? A. Hancock gets drunk and pukes on a kid. B. Hancock kills an old woman's cat by knocking down a tree and crushing it. C. Hancock has an orgasm that blows a hole through the roof. D. Hancock flashes a random one while he's in his bathrobe. Five, four, three, two, and one. It's hurting. What do you say? I'm gonna, I'm gonna go with, uh, I'm gonna go with A. Hancock gets drunk and pukes on a kid. Oh, you know what? You puked all over that answer. Damn. It's wrong. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Oh, 
Answer C, Hancock has an orgasm <laughs> that blows a hole through the roof. The deleted scene is included in the unrated version of the film, which was initially titled Tanike Comes. <laughs> Seriously. Wow. <laughs> like the way you said that. Oh, I thought that was in the movie. I thought he had sex and he blows like a whole lot. Yeah. All right, well, there you go. Well, you're, you're looking at it right there. Never mind, yeah, I guess that, that, that scene. I like the way you said that. Tonight, he comes. Comes. Yeah. <laughs> hey, you want to see the scene? Yeah. You want to see that bit of pornography? Why not? Why not? Yeah. <laughs> did he just throw a hoe across the room? I guess so. I guess so. Yeah, he did it to save her life. Yeah, yeah. Well, she was fully Ooh. clothed though. That was weird. Unless he was just premature. Oh man, maybe, maybe so. Maybe Very just, premature. Maybe, maybe he just couldn't wait. <laughs> I guess so. <laughs> maybe he had his hand in his cock. Yeah. All right. Fair enough. I've never seen this scene before. It's <laughs> the name Hancock. Ah, ah, there it is. Ah, yeah. ah mm, you, I got I, it. You took your off of that one, didn't it? I got it. Yep. 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 Mm -hmm. No. Yep. How many animators are working many... on the upcoming movie <laughs> <laughs> Spider-Man Across the Spider-Verse? A, 250, B, 2000, C, 1000, D, 500. Five, four, three, two, and one. What do you say there, Chris? I'm gonna go with 1000. Go, go with C, 1000. 1000. C, 1000. Yeah, right in the middle. Hey, you know what? You're gonna be happy to see finally a right answer. Hey! Hey! hey. What'd you say, A? No, that's no, wrong. No, okay, no, well, no. Uh, you I should. What did you say? I you changed your mind? A? I said A like in yay. Yay. Okay, then. But I said then. C. C. 1,000. C. 1,000. Yeah. Let's see. Let's see if that's hey. right. Hey. Hey. Answer C, 1000. At Cinemacon 2022, producers Phil Lord and Chris Miller revealed that 1000 <laughs> animators are working on Across the Spider-Verse, a record for an animated feature film. Steven Dorff did a great job in the role as Blade's vampire antagonist, Deacon Frost, but another actor was heavily considered for the role. Who was it? A, Skeet Ulrich, B, Leonardo DiCaprio, C, Ryan Felipe, or D, Mark Wahlberg? Uh, it's Felipe. His name anyway. is Felipe to me. <laughs> That's just racist. Yes. What do you say? Oh, wow. Uh, you know, I'm going to go with my boy Marky Mark. D, Mark Wahlberg. You're right. <laughs> That's right. That's right. That's right. Hey. hey, you went with your boy, you got it right. I was almost a vampire. Can hey. you believe it? I hey. couldn't believe it. I'm sucking blood out of people. Hey. I'm Blade's dad. Yo, wow. And <laughs> hey, we're going to beat his black ass. I don't really understand it. I'm a white guy. He's a black guy. But hey, that's what happens hey. when you're a vampire. Hey, I heard we had a Negro vampire in the neighborhood. <laughs> <laughs> It's Mark Wahlberg. No offense to Mr. Wahlberg, but we're happy Stephen Dorff got the job. Skeletor was not considered, but he did lobby heavily for the role. And he didn't get it. In Meteor Man, a well-known comedian gets no screen time, but his voice can be heard over a small, uh, excuse me, over a mall speaker. Who is that comedian? A, Dave Chappelle, B, Chris Rock, C, Martin Lawrence, or D, Chris Tucker? Five, four, three, two. Being the big fan of Meteor Man that you are, you got this. <laughs> go ahead. I haven't seen this movie in years. Uh, I'm gonna go with uh, B, Chris Rock. Chris Rock? Yeah. Hey, hey. Wrong Chris. <laughs> yeah. <Damn it. laughs> uh, you almost had it. You were yeah. almost there. You yeah. had the first name, right? Whoops. Sorry, wrong Chris. Ah, uh, answer D, Chris Tucker. Two years before Tucker was in the movie Friday, he was heard but not seen as the MC of the mall. All right, then. You want to hear him? Didn't get it. Yeah, I do. Let me see. I, got, I think I got the clip of him. Hey, man. Who's that? Hey, that? man. Hey, I'm in a mall speaker. <laughs> you can hear me. Sounds about right. <laughs> you hear the sound of my voice? Sounds pretty accurate. Hey. Ah, <laughs> screaming. <laughs> let's see. All right. What let's, hear see? let's hear him. Damn, media man. And I want to say hello to all the lovely ladies out there. Because I figure now is the time. Because crime is at an all time high. And, That's know, Chris Tucker? I don't know. All that sounds like Chris Rock. Mm. Hey, you know what? Uh, all black people sound like to me. <laughs> That oh, sounds okay. like Chris Rock. Play it again. I want to hear it again. Thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, let's give it up for me, man. That is Chris Rock. Yes. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I'm, I'm only going with what I'm told. Uh-huh. <laughs> Chad, it's Tucker. That does not sound like Chris Tucker. Yeah. I thought you said it's going to sound like Corey. <laughs> no. Hey, <laughs> man. Welcome to the show. Corey doesn't screech that much. 
Well, we're at the beginning of the show. <laughs> and Chris got racist here. It sounded like Chris rocked to me. <laughs> wow, you were so shit. That is not Chris Dagger. What? <laughs> He sounds that like Fred Brown. I was like, it sounds like Marty the Zebra. That's who it sounds like to me. Yeah, mm-hmm. yeah. Maybe all oh, black people well. sound like to you. I guess they do. Yeah, man. You got to work on that. <laughs> Hi, I'm Obama the president. How y'all doing? It sounds like yeah. It sounds like Barack Obama's in the room. With all us black right people there. sound like to you. <laughs> I guess Lou, so. I'm your father. Yeah. Shit. Oh my god. <laughs> James Earl Jones sounds uh, a little high pitch. Yeah. Ten dollars. Ten bucks. Ten dollars here. Ten bucks. Spin again. Two. Oh. He just saw spin again. Okay. He's so close to dying all the time. Always, always, always. All right. That delay though. I think well, it's let's see certain. what we got here. All right. I think it. he likes the suspense. He does. Yeah. All right. There's the wheel. Okay. There's the beach ball again. Beach ball again. Let's see what we got here. <laughs> Zimbuchi. <laughs> and Zimbuchi is Corey Batiste for. Nothing. nothing. You get nothing. You get nothing. Nothing. Let's play a game. A what a if, little, if you will? A little, a little game of what if. Bonus round. Oh, bonus round. Oh, not real. No bonus. bonus round. It means but nothing. Fake bonus round. It's, round. it's not fake. real. Bonus. Bonus round. Fake rounds. Fake round. Fake bonus. Bonus. Bonus fake. round. Fake. Round bonus. <laughs> okay, stop. Yay. Let's go ahead and see that now. Okay. Question, bonus round question number six. Read it. In Spawn, John Lee Guizamo's clown costume was so large and cumbersome, it caused him to A, piss himself, B, stand for hours because sitting caused him too often, well, I'm sorry, uh, A. <laughs> it's like an eighth well, grade well, book well, report. Let well, me read it again. <laughs> edit, edit, edit this. A, piss himself. B, stand for hours because sitting caused him too often roll away. <laughs> C, pass out from the intensity. You're about to pass out for reading these questions right here. (laughs) D, have someone feed him because the costume's fat fingers couldn't hold food well. (laughs) I'm about to make these answers shorter for you. (laughs) Some up there again, some of them I didn't even understand. I want to stand for hours because sitting (laughs) caused them too often. Roll Roll away. Roll away. Roll away. (laughs) You're like a seven-year-old reading for the first time. You gotta put two. You gotta put a two often two roll away. I'm sorry. Yes. <laughs> two often. Ah, whatever. Well, what I'm gonna think? go with that one. I'll go with the one I couldn't say. All right. <laughs> I'll go with B. Yeah. I'll go with B. Yeah. <laughs> roll away. <laughs> it's like that. Yeah. Rolled away from my right answer too. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> ah, you uh, want to know what the right answer? Yes. Yeah, let's do it. Answer A. Piss himself. Trapped inside the costume, he couldn't go to the bathroom. So when he leaves himself on the spot, that's fair. <laughs> there you go. Yeah, Fun awesome. trivia we had today. That was good. I know. Learn something. I know a little bit about black superheroes. Yeah, you do. A little bit. A, li- I, a little bit. Uh, I know about the good ones. Yeah. <laughs> as long as they're not talking. <laughs> hey, that's Chris Rock. <laughs> <laughs> Sound like Chris Rock to me. I was like, Chris Tucker. Hmm. All right. You say so. The chat has spoken. Well, they said it's Chris Tucker. Okay. Hmm. Hey, everyone. Did you have fun? Then remember to like, subscribe, and if you want to try your hand at trivia, hit us up at our email address provided in the description below. Thank you. Bye.